Hello, beautiful people. Hope everybody doing well. I'm here in Mexico, the state of Hidalgo, which is about an hour away from Mexico City. Mexico City is actually also a Mexico state. So I'm about an hour away from that. Family and relative is here, so I'm visiting them. And today one of my uncle invited me to see how to do the barbacoa. Do some video there. Delicious barbacoa made by lamb cooked under the ground uh, for long hours, maybe 12 or 14 hours. So let's go, we're gonna check it out. This is the Leon house where he do his business and also his resident. This is the one of the back of their house and you can see lots of wood because they use only wood. So this is cooking in a wood, not anything else, no electrical, no gas. It's a wood, it's very natural and the taste is different. We have a fresh chicken here. Yeah. Oh, look at this chicken. Is it a durazno? Durazno. We have Sylvia showing us the house. I came here 20, 20 years ago, 20 years antes yo llegué, no aquí. <laughs> this is another Tio. You can see him right there. You can see his head. That's Tio Chano. Leon CB. Cervantes Banderas. Si. Ah. You see behind all those knives here? Those are the knives to slaughter the lamb. The lamb basically is slaughtered right here wash it here after the wash they hang it right here see that this is this is penca de maguey this is going to be covered and this is the fire going on and here is the borrego Oh, this is going to be cooked in there. <laughs> this is our Tio Leon. Sí, no? Hola, Tio Leon. ¿Qué pasó? <laughs> Tio Leon is the own this place. Uh, he makes lots of barbacoa. ¿Cómo ves? ¿Cuánto horas? Tres. ¿Tres horas? Tres horas adentro, no. Tres para que la eche yo. Uh -huh. Patas, ajá. Esta es la panza Pero verde. Sí. Panza, ajá. Esta es la panza roja. Panza roja, ok. ¿Eso qué? Cabezas. Cabezas, ah. Cabezas. La cabeza de borrego. Borrego, ajá. Las envuelvo para que no se, no se sequen. Ajá. La cabeza and everything gonna be go inside. Including the patas, which is the legs, the stomach, the head of the ship. All gonna go in the barbacoa. You know, this is remind me something tandoori. This is a similar process as you see the head around. 
Tandoori is like more smaller mouth, but inside is bigger. But this is same circle, it's more bigger. Morocco has also similar process, but here is a little different because they put maguey. Maguey gonna give the taste of the lamb is a little different. So that is the secret. You see the fire, the fire going to be settled down. They're gonna put the borrego inside and then it's gonna cover totally. So there'll be no steam gonna be escaped and they're gonna cook for 12 to 14 hours. Máximo cuánto puede poner. Aquí en este. Ajá. Cuatro borregos. ¿Cuatro? Sí. Cuatro borregos de 50. De 50 kilos. Cada, cada borrego 50. Sí. Los que estamos echando son de 43, 42. Puro tierno. ¿Eso para qué? Ya. Para que no se pegue la carne. No se pegue la carne. Ah. Y se cosa bien. 400. No. Si un borrego de 40 kilos se canta para 50 personas.
¿A los dos? No, sí. Quita la tierra y empieza. ¿Qué hora más o menos? Como dos y media. Dos y media. ¿no? Dos y media. Look, tío León, ice es verde. <laughs> Blue ice. De ojo green. verde. ¿Verde? Sí, no. Ajá. Ajá, o sí. <laughs> sí. <laughs> They have to supply this food to another pueblo, which is means another city. And they're going to be an auto show. So those lamb that he put it in there, this is about 42 to 45 kilo each. So there was four of them. As you see, all the stomach, the head, and the legs, uh, everything is in there. And the, all the juice that's gonna come out, that's gonna be drip in that bowl, big bowl that you see that they put it with all the vegetables and everything. And there will be also um, garbanzos in there. So usually, consume is very famous, uh, not only in Mexico, many places, but different kind of consume. Consume basically means it's a clear broth, clear soup. You can see through, that's all. So you see how this preparation is done, right? So now as the borrego is cooking, we're gonna see how they remove the whole lamb and it's cooked 12 to 14 hours. Right now, it's about 12 noon. We're gonna come back at 2.30 in the morning. So it's about 14 hours and a half. It's about 2 o'clock in the morning. Not really actually. 2.20. The dog is crazy. Two or three o'clock in the morning in the street, usually nobody there, you know. I'm in front of the house of Tio Leon, but you know, for them it's a daily life. Nobody opening. I don't know even their wake up, <laughs> but they should be wake up. That's why they told me, come at 2 a.m. or 2.15 a.m. This is the time we're going to uh, remove the borrego from the ground. You know, this is month of August. It's supposed to be a summer, cold. As you see, I'm just putting some blanket. I have not bring any jacket uh, because I thought, you know, it's not going to be that much cold, but it's really two o'clock in the morning. It is cold. Still waiting. Nobody opening the door. I mean, nobody opening the gate. The borrego will be out from the oven and it's already cooked. I can smell it. It smells so good.
porque llegamos allá a las 5 a las No, estas son puras. This is very hard work, really. I can see him from the beginning, how he put it in, the whole borrego. There was a four of them and now it's cooked, taking out from the oven and fill up his you know, boxes and pot that way he had to bring it to the little town where the big Chiang is going on, which is means fiesta. There will be about 3,000 people gonna come there. So this meat gonna be sell over there. The important salsa, right? When you make the borrego, how are you going to eat it? Salsa is a very vital part of borrego. So Tia, Sylvia now making the salsa. Let's check it out. Preparation was almost 45 minutes just to remove from the ground. They're gonna go to Chiangis and they'll be making taco for all day long and that's their business. The place called in here called Barbacoa Leon Cervantes. So this is Tio Leon. Now we're gonna go to Tio's place and we're gonna have some taco there from the same lamb. Let's go.
¿Ha comido eso? Sí. No, pero el eh, que la forma de los pobrecitos, no, te va a We're going to try some consomme. Dice que nos quiere recarga. Yo creo del café. Pero ahorita cambia de como el clima. Ya, ya tiene. Ya, tío. Gracias. I'm going to try this. Consomme. This is very famous place for barbacoa. Which is like this one. See that? Taco is all time in Mexico. Morning, afternoon, snacks, dinner. <laughs> this taco is awesome. Oh, the sauce is very hot. I'm going to show you something. Um, stomach of the lamb. This is also edible. And they make also taco. Taco de panza, huh? Taxi. Tastes a little different. Tastes awesome. Now I'm going to drink some Mexican coffee. Javier, ¿qué tal? Javier, ¿qué tal? Javier, Please give me a thumbs up. Please don't forget to subscribe. There's a bell icon there. If you click that when my next video comes, you'll be the first to be notified. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.